Time to do some maintenance. 220 sand miles on it. Get a little twist as they go in. Got 331 miles on it now. 332 if you look at that dash. Time to do some maintenance. Um, right now we're just doing a little short little video and show you how we're going to do the air filter on here. By the way, these gauges right here, I'm reading on some of the forums that somewhere there's like three gauges on here with one in the middle that you can actually put boost percentage on. And I've gone through all the settings and everything and I, I can't find anything that show me, me how to get that to display. If you guys know how to make that display with the boost percentage in the middle, leave me a comment. Let me know. Thanks. So easy access to the air filter. Uh, car's got a little over 300 miles on it. Probably doesn't have to have maintenance done, but uh, being it's a new car, I like to get that done. Here's the air filter. Same as for your X3s. Um, air filter is only the same, not the oil filter. Let's get started. Okay, so unlike the X3, this is a little easier to get to. Got these standard clips to get to here. One, two, three, and four. Uh, relatively easy to get this off. See how she looks. Got about 220 sand miles on it, about 90 or 110, whatever it works out to the math of trail riding. Pull her out. Give a little twist as I pull. And not too bad. Let's give it the uh, shake test. Wow, that's actually pretty good. Let's see how it does with the blowing some air through it. Not bad at all. Show you the number. This is the original air filter ending in 422, which is the same as on the box ending in 422. Same air filter calls for on the X3. So I like to uh, kind of blow out the air box a little bit, I'll put a rag. At the turbo inlet side, a little blow. Not bad. Wipe out the rest. Then I'll take my filter here, and they didn't have it on there from the factory, but I'm going to put a little grease for some extra seal. Just a little extra there. Get this thing sealed. Don't put too much. Get a little twist as they go in. Get my cap back on there. The cap can go any four directions. It doesn't have to go a certain way. That's all there is to it. So we're just getting started on the maintenance on this car. Uh, oil will be next. I got a little treat for you on that. I figured out something that's going to be really cool. Uh, remember, it's a whole different setup. We got two different oil drain plugs. This is a lot easier to get to. No funny funnels to go through the bed with or anything like that. So stay tuned. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.